Audio Reactive Stable Diffusion This is a question that often comes up when I post my animations on YouTube or Twitter. Is it done natively in Deforum Diffusion or is it post-processed? Unfortunately Deforum Diffusion doesn't have any built-in tools to animate the visuals to music, but there are a couple of good notebooks that you can use in tandem to make your videos dance. The first one I'll cover is the one I use the most, it's a notebook called Audio Reactive Video 1.1. So to get this to work you'll need a piece of audio and a video. The notebook will speed up your video based on the volume of your audio. The loud peaks in the audio will be the fast parts of your video, the quiet bits will go slow. For this reason your video needs to be much longer than your sound file. Begin by connecting your Google Drive and copy pasta the paths to your video and audio files. Hit the play icons and wait while the notebook splits your video into frames. This might take a while depending on how many frames you have. In the rendering audio step if you hit this error there's probably an easy fix, I don't code so I don't know it. What I do know, is if you convert your mp3 to a WAV file you can get it to work with a couple of tweaks. I used Audacity because it's free and easy. You open your file and export it as a WAV into your Google Drive folder. Now if you update the path pointing to your audio to your new WAV file and rerun the cell it should work. Note you don't have to split your frames again so skip this cell. Now hit play on the create list of selected frames and pay attention to the message. If it says you don't have enough frames you can bring the slider down and rerun until it works. The lower you go with this slider the less dramatic the audio reaction will be. If it keeps saying you don't have enough frames try reducing the music's length or making your video longer. You can use a video interpolation notebook like Film to do this or local software like Flow Frames. Now if we run this final cell it'll do its thing and kind of fail again. To get it to work you need to copy the WAV file from earlier into the root of the directory and rename it temp underscore audio. If you run the final cell again it'll work its magic and you'll have an audio reactive animated file. This isn't the most elegant way but it works. If you happen to know something about coding and how to fix that first issue, please drop a comment. The other notebook I know of uses the audio file to create keyframes for your camera move. So you render your video in Deform Diffusion with the reactive movement baked in. I'll drop a link to it in the description of this video and might cover it in a video another day. The video that I used for this tutorial was only 2 minutes 40 long put to a 2 minute song. As you'll see the effect isn't very strong. If you want a more dramatic effect like in my other videos you really need your video to be at least twice as long as your song. Hopefully this video's helped. Like and subscribe for more AI related art videos and tips.